The city of Chico is making progress clearing homeless camps from parks and greenways. And so far, crews have cleared people and trash from, we're looking at Lower Bidwell Park, we're looking at the Lindo Channel from 99 all the way to Holly Avenue, as well as downtown Chico. And that's where we find Action News Now reporter Ryan Ketchum. Ryan, how is this all affecting businesses there in the downtown area? Yeah, businesses haven't had too much of an impact here. Haley, Thomas Hightower of Pita Pit, which is actually at this location right here behind me, says that they've actually seen fewer people in their store ever since the school graduations, even though a lot of people are making their way out to City Plaza and enjoying the downtown Thursday night market and Friday night concerts. The streets are cleaner. I do give them that. Uh, there is less of the homeless traffic downtown, um, but I'm still waiting the increase of every other traffic, all the rest of the traffic. The city moved through downtown homeless camps about a month ago, and Carrie Smith says she's loved the change, especially to Lower Bidwell Park. We love going there, bringing our lunch, sitting back and enjoying it. And we went through a time where it just had been taken over by the tents and the homeless and it just seemed dirty to me, so we stopped going. Smith now goes back frequently, but most of the people I spoke with today say they don't see the tents, but they also haven't seen a big change. Town's been pretty much the same. I haven't, I didn't even know there really were changes happening or if they were implemented yet, but it's just been pretty fine, I'd say. There are still several groups of homeless people throughout the plaza and downtown Chico. They just live in other campsites now. By pushing these people out of the downtown area, they've just pushed them to other like districts and housing areas. Uh, it hasn't eliminated their homelessness. The city can't force the homeless into the pallet shelter. It can only recommend it to the people that it meets with. The city is asking for the public's help, though, to be able to make sure the homeless do not move back to areas that the city already cleared through. We're counting on uh, the residents to keep us informed if they see something. Um, we certainly are going to do some checks every now and then just to make sure. Um, but, uh, you know, so far uh, it's been good. We haven't had a lot of movement back. The city originally handed out seven day notices to homeless camps here in downtown Chico on May 9th and all the homeless people were moved out and all the trash cleared out of those camps by May 23rd. Coming up at six, I'll break down for you how some families are enjoying these newly cleared out parks. Reporting live in downtown Chico, I'm Ryan Ketchum. Action News Now, coverage you can count on. Thanks, Ryan. The city will decide what homeless camp it will clear out next during a closed session meeting next week.